Hi everyone, welcome to my Dollar Tree haul. And I did get my hair cut. I don't know if you can tell, but um, I got layers and a, like a side swept bang. I don't know if you guys can tell. And I also dyed my hair in the medium brown color. Um, and this is a Dollar Tree haul, as I hopefully I said. I just wanted to let you guys know about my hair. And I like it. It's different. And I love to change my hair a lot. So, anyway, speaking of hair, I did get some hair color from Dollar Tree. So, I guess I'm going to start with beauty. So, I got two boxes of this um, hair color. And it is the medium brown. And I've used this for a long time. I don't even know. Probably years. And I really like this hair color. So, I was using the, I think, dark brown, but now I'm going to go back to the medium brown. And I got some of these fur flops. I got it in the gray and, the, like, this neon green. So, I really love those. Those are really cute. And they had a lot of different colors. And I did get some of the new Bolero stuff. The new scents. So, I didn't get the coconut and vanilla, I think it was are coconut and verbena that is the new coconut i don't like the coconut scent in the bolero really but i wanted to try the three other new scents so i got the pineapple and coconut and lime and i got the um what is this the pure vegetable soap and then also i got the shower gel and at this time, these are the only products that I found at the Dollar Trees I go to. I got the shampoo and the conditioner. And this smells a lot like pineapple. Yeah, I smell the pineapple mainly in this um, scent. Then I got tooth items in the um, peonies and pear. So I got the pure vegetable soap and it's soothing it says and then I got the shower gel and this one is very floral so it's more like the peonies scent I think and then the watermelon and mint I got the um, pure vegetable soap and then I got the shampoo and conditioner. And then I got the shower gel. And this one smells a lot like water. It does have like, it has like equal, like the mint and the watermelon. You can smell in this one. But the, the watermelon is the main um, scent. And then I got the Six Blade Razors by Sure. And I got this lipstick. It's LA Colors and the color is Vibe. So it's sort of a um, fuchsia color. And I got some of these Restful Sleep Melatonin Gummies. I don't think I've tried this one. But I have tried a couple other um, brands from Dollar Tree. So I haven't tried the Restores brand. It says it's vegetarian, gluten free. And it helps promote relaxation and sleep. And I think the serving size is 2. So, take these like a couple hours before you um, go to bed and before you go to sleep and you should get a good restful sleep and I don't feel tired the next day or anything from taking the melatonin. And then I got the um, Daily Defense. I got the Ocean Minerals Body Wash. I know it smells like... It has like that fresh ocean scent. It's with sea kelp extract. And it's free of parabens and silicones. 
And then I got the one, the Fresh Rose Essence. Also the Daily Defense. And this one is with jojoba oil. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. And this one smells like rose. Yeah, it smells like that rose, that, you know, like that rose scent. And that's a really pretty bottle. I got these two hairspray. I got two of these hairspray. And this is in the Got To Be. This is Glam Force High Hold Hairspray. It says 48 hour hold, non-sticky, and anti-frizz. So I got two of those. And some people did say some things about the, sh the mousses and gels, I think, that they didn't like them. So hopefully I will like those. And then I got the My Cellar Cleansing Water Makeup Remover and Moisturizer. And I got one of these to put it in because I like to use these in my, when I use my cotton rounds. Then I got some of these little wristlets. So I got this one, which is like the new little spring um, line that they have out now in Dollar Tree. And then these are like, they remind me of like the Vera Bradley um, things. And this is called a keychain wallet. And it does have a place for like your, um, it is, wait, I'm sorry. Yeah, it does. You can put like your driver's license in here in this part. And then you can put like whatever you want in this part. So here's one design. And then this is another one. And I like to use like these little wristlets and wallets and stuff to organize my purse. And then I got just the black, what are these called? These are just called wristlets. I just got a black one and I got this, this one. And then I got two of these eye masks. So this one says Beauty Queen. And the reason why I got that, I don't really like that saying. But this was like the only one at one of my stores. So that's why I picked that one up. And then I do like this saying that says Offline. I love to wear those when I sleep at night. And I got one of these Spa Scriptions applicators. It's a silicone face mask applicator and I did get this from I did get I have two of these already from Family Dollar and um that came with like a few of their um, masks so this is gonna be my third one and I'm also using one now by Freeman and it works really good so I've heard pretty good things about that and then I got two perfumes and these are the Caribbean Joe Island perfumes. So I got this one that is Misty Nights. And this is what the bottle looks like. And they had um, a third scent. I only got two scents. I don't really know how to describe the scent that I got, but when I spray them on myself in the store, I like them. So this one is another one of those, Caribbean Joe Island. This one is Sunset Dreams. And I'll show you what the bottle looks like. It looks like that. It's hard to tell you what they smell like because I think you have to like let it dry and I don't really have time for that because I have a really huge haul and 
But what I do is to test the perfumes at Dollar Tree or any store, just spray it on you because your body chemistry can change the scent of the perfume. Spray it on you and then kind of walk around the store and then come back and or put it in your cart and see if you like it. Then if you don't like it, you can put it back. And if you do like it, then you can take it with you. <laughs> okay, so that is all the beauty section. This is the decor part of the haul. So I'm going to start with these. Um, signs that I got, I guess they're called, I don't know what they're called exactly. They're ju they just say decor. So, I got this one that says laugh. I got memories. I got a family. And I'm gonna set these on a shelf. I may I might spray paint some of these. I got live. I got XOXO. But you can also hang these up if you want to. I'm probably gonna just put them on a shelf. And I got love. I got these. Um I got two of these. They're the flower and garden. I guess they're planters, but I'm going to use them for like a uh, floral arrangement. So I got two different kinds. I have an idea for these and I'll kind of tell you guys about the idea. And of course, you know, I will show you in my video one day. On the inside of one of those was this. Um, this is a macaroon hinged box. And I saw these when they first came out, but I didn't never pick one up. And so I picked one up to put in my bedroom, and it is the, um, like, mint color one. And then last time I picked up some of the pearls. I think this is either the medium size or the biggest size that they have. So I have a small size that I got from Walmart, and now I have a medium size, and then this big size are, I don't know if this is the medium one. I think this is the largest size. Then I got a bunch of um, the succulents, because I want to use them in like flower arrangements and um, other things. So I got this one, and I got this one. I'm probably going to take, I don't I'll probably take them out of these little, um, planters that they're in. Yeah. They're called potted succulents. Then I got some of the succulent picks. So this one is a really cool, I didn't see this one before at the Dollar Tree. And then I got this one. And then this one. I love that pop of green. And then this one. And this one. And then I got two of these decorative grapes. And this is for one of those planter, those planters that I just showed you. I'm going to do an arrangement with these grapes and the, one of those planters. And I got some ivy that I'm also going to use in that floral arrangement. And I will show you guys. And then I got this. It's, I think this is um, flowers. I think this says flowers and garden in French. And I actually got this for my bathroom. I'm going to sit it on the back of my toilet and put like toilet paper and maybe like a little flower arrangement in there. If you guys want to see like that, let me know and I'll show you. But it's just going to be like, I'm just going to put like a roll of toilet paper and like a little decoration and just sit it on the back of my toilet and probably put like that um, poo spray that we got at the Dollar Tree before put one of those in there. I'm also going to put one in my son's bathroom. 
for guests like in the summertime. Let me show you guys the floral that I got. So this is, the first one is green, greenery bouquet. And this reminds me of ivy, but I'm not really good with naming plants, but I got this to use with those grapes in a flower arrangement and one of those um, flower and garden planters that I showed you guys. And this is going to go on another one of those, a different one. I needed like a big white flower. So I'm probably going to use one or only one or two of these. And what are these called? Magnolias. And these have got to be like fluffed out or something because they are just looking smashed. Then I got two of these orange, like orange roses for that, to go with that white flower, that big white flowers. Two of these. And this is greenery bouquet also. I got two of these and I got these just like for filler. Or I may use these in like um, a basis in my living room. I'm not sure. And then I got one of these long stem red roses. And I got this for a, to do like a picture. Like, you know, like for just for photo shoot. For a photo shoot or something. And it will look really nice to have like that kind of picture for Valentine's Day. <laughs> but yeah, I just have it now. I got. Two of these, um, they're floral foam. I got two of them, and these are just for some flower arrangements that I want to do. The ones probably that I was telling you guys about. And I found the medium size and the small size of this, and I finally found the larger size. They're gift boxes, but they have the mermaid. And I'm probably going to use these in my bedroom to... Um, put makeup in. And I got one of these um, trinket trays. And the one that I got, it says, smiles are always in fashion. And I got the, like, the teal color. This color is, like, I have a lot of that in my bedroom, so that's why I picked it up. And then I got some spring and Easter items. So I got two garden flags. And one of them is this one. It's a bicycle and it says welcome. And then this one is a hummingbird that says welcome. And I just really love hummingbirds. Ever since um, I show the Vampire Diaries and the originals and Klaus and Caroline. And that like they have they they have like this hummingbird thing. So I love hummingbirds for that reason, I think. And then I got some bunny picks. I got the um, blue and the purple. I wish I would have got the pink one now. And I don't know if they have a green one or not. And then I got two of these. Wait, I got three of these actually. These are the floral foam also. And I got these and I also got a foam board because I want to make something that I saw another YouTuber make and when I do make it and I share it with you guys I will link her channel and her video so that way you guys can make it if you want to but I haven't even did it I haven't done any crafting so I haven't made it yet of course <laughs> and then I got some of these eggs these are like the speckled robin eggs or no this one like these two probably look like robin eggs like the blue one but these are just like speckled eggs and they are so cute. I don't know. Robin's eggs are blue, right? And then I got this um, ceramic painting set. And I got it for the little bunny because I think last year I wanted to do something with the little bunny and I couldn't find it. They got the bunnies were gone quick. So this year I found the bunny. And I think that's all I got for like spring and Easter decor. 
Okay, I got us some of these wild decals because um, we do rent, so we will be moving sometime. And I have like a um, family, um, not a, like a photo wall, a gallery wall. I don't know. I guess that's what you call it. And I use these to decorate. So when we move, I can have these for that or if I want to change things up while we're here. But this one is Amazing Grace. And the reason why I love this, this is my grandma's, or was my grandma's favorite song. So, I think this would be something special to have on my gallery wall to look at and like kind of remind me of her. So, I picked that up. And this one says, Grateful, Thankful, and Blessed. And, you know, this one is just blessed. It's good to be grateful, thankful, and blessed. And then this one is probably, like, for in here for, like, fun. And it's just, like, the unicorn. And it's supposed to look like that. And then this one is the arrows. And really, I'm not, like, into arrows, really. But I do love, like, the flowers. So that's mostly why I pick, picked this up. I picked up this red bottle because I have a lot of red in my kitchen. And I'm going to put those lights in this um, bottle. You know, the bottle lights that we got. I'm going to take this off. And put it in, put the lights in here for my kitchen. If you guys want to see that after I put the lights in, just let me know and I will share it with you. And then I got some raffia. And this kind of goes with these. These are, I know they're sauna pepper shakers, but I got these for decor. I'm going to paint these like a light blue color. And then I'm going to probably tie some of this around it. And I think I'm going to put some of those, um... Flow, some flowers that I got from the Dollar Tree in this. And I will share it with you guys after I do that. I got the paint from Walmart. Like the light blue paint. And then I got one of these moss sheets. And I got some paint brushes. I got some green acrylic paint. And what I'm going to do. I got one of these. And I don't know how big this is going to be. It's not going to be very big, but I wanted to do a birdhouse. One of my friends, Kiera, she got a birdhouse from the Dollar Tree, and I think hers is definitely bigger than this, and she didn't have to put it together. This is like a wood shop birdhouse, and I think it's, I think I got this, yeah, this was in the craft section at my Dollar Tree, but I'm pretty sure this is probably like for little kids to put together, <laughs> and hopefully I can put it together. It does have a, like quite a bit of pieces back here. But I think it would be cute, and I was going to paint the house, this part of the house, white, and then I was going to paint the roof green. That's why I got the green paint and the paint brushes. And then I was going to put some of this um, moss sheet on the roof also. So if you guys, if this works out, um, I will share it with you guys. And I got this little decorative tray to go in my bedroom where my makeup is because um, I think this would be nice. Like if there's like some lipsticks that I want to try, I can like set them in here. And I have the little sign, the little um, stand tile wear crown or something. I think it says something like that. Pineapple sign. So I thought that would be cute to like go together with that sign. And then I got one of these for that says this one is. The English version, Flowers and Garden. And this is for my son's bathroom slash guest bathroom for the same reason. I'm going to put toilet paper and then like maybe a flower arrangement in, the, in this one. Then I picked up this sign. And this is a spring fling decor sign. And I just love the little bees. Like, the bees are the reason why I picked this up. And I'm just going to put this um, outside probably. Or, I don't know. Let's see. 
Does that first picture have the bees? Yeah. Those bees are just so cute. And this part says keep life simple. And then, yeah. So, I think this is a cute sign. And I got these last time, the last haul I did. They're beaded necklaces. There's eight. And they are silver and gold. And I just got them so I could have extra of them because I can never find them like I told you guys last time. And I got these two coasters that say grateful and blessed. So there's the grateful one. And then this is blessed. And then I got some candles. Even though I haven't been a fan lately of these. Um, the Dollar Tree candles. But I'm going to try them again. So I got two of the. I get two of them all the time. So I got the marshmallow and lavender. And... It does smell like marshmallows and lavender, and I hope it has a good throw. I think I heard that it didn't, but I'm going to still try it and see. And then I got the, I got two of the um, peach bellini. This smells like peaches. Hopefully they have a good throw. I think there's one at Bath and Body Works called peach bellini. And then I just got this one for decoration because my room is like teal, marble, floral. So I got the marble candle and this one is called Spiced Tea Toddy. And there were some flannel scented candles, but I feel like this one is this one was my favorite scent. And I just got one to decorate my bedroom with. So that is all the decor that I got. Now I'm going to do stationery. So, I got a lot of stickers. So, and because I love to do my planner. And I got these um, bunny stickers for Easter. So, I love the one with the umbrella, the ballet bunny, the like glam bunny. Super cute. And then I got some of these planner stickers. And these are kind of um, like Friday brunch. Let's see. Reminder stickers. And then the back is like grocery shopping. Are just shopping, travel, it's got the car and the plane, it's got a cupcake that you could probably use as like a birthday sticker, and it has, so this is the other side. And then this one is, got ice cream and fry again, and adventure, so travel stickers, Boy and Voyage, and Dream Big, Cars, and then the back has um, Road Trip, Day Trip, and it has some ice cream, it has a globe with an adventure on it. Then this one is TGIF, Appointments and To Do. And test and study and note. And don't forget reminder stickers. And then on the back it has like some more study stickers. Ice cream, nap time, let's party, school starts, laundry, final, spring break, summer break, winter break. So this is good for if you're a student or you want to give this to your kids because they're students and they use a planner or you just want to use it in your planner to like remember like your kids have winter break or spring break and then this one is date night treat your treat yourself 
wine down, but W I N E. I don't do. I don't drink wine or anything like alcohol. I don't drink alcohol. Um, but date night is nice. Treat yourself is nice. Relax, family time. All of those are nice. And on the back, there's like coffee date and a birthday cake. Laundry with the little um, iron. And school's out. These are good for like moms, I think. I love the little laundry one with the iron. That's cute. Then I got these jot stickers. And those were jot too. These are like happy birthday and these are like three different um, stickers. So the first one is happy birthday with the cake and it's really colorful. It has like a banner. So that is a really fun. And then this is the second row. It has like surprise party, celebrate happy birthday, all about you, party time. And then this one is just alpha letter, alphas. Alphabet, ABCs. <laughs> then I got the spring one. So this one has flowers and it just says spring. And then this one is live, love, laugh. Live for today, fresh air. So just kind of like spring inspirational quotes. And it looks like that. The simple life, enjoy, lovely, laugh often. Oh, I love this one. And then letters. I think that's my favorite. Oh, and, but I love all three. They had another one too. I can't remember what it was now. This one said it's like Fourth of July themed. It says USA, and it has the map, the flag, in the shape of the United States. Oh, that's cool. I love the Fourth of July. And then this one is um, Fourth of July freedom hero, Independence Day patriot. Love the USA, my hometown, made in America. Oh my god, I love that. And then ABCs. And then I got this puzzle. This is like, it says it's called Windows. It's 300 pieces. But this reminds me of a restaurant in downtown Wilmington where I live. And like, it just reminds me of that restaurant. It also reminds me of like, New Orleans or something. I don't know why, but it does. I love this. And I got some pencils for my son for school. He loves the mechanical pencils. So I got him these. And then my son, I had a set of these um, clip clicks by ink. And they are eight ballpoint pens and they are assorted ink. And I gave, my son used them, so I just gave him the other set. So I bought me another set. And then I bought me and my son these are just me one to have at the house. And then him one to put like in his binder for school. So these are the Crayola pencil and crayon sharpeners. So hopefully they work good. So I got these two different ones. And I got a bookmark that says just one more chapter because I love to read. And it's a real wood bookmark. And it has like a little purple. Well, I don't know what color. It's like iridescent. It looks purple to me right now. But I love that little bead. And I love to read. Then I got some mermaid things because I love mermaid. That, the mermaid theme. So this is a notebook and it says strong women make the waves. And then I will open it in case some of you haven't seen it. How it is um, built. Oh no, I just tore it. Anyways, I might have to buy a new one now or tape that up. So it's Velcroed in. The paper is really thin, but it's lined paper. It's got green lines to kind of match the notebook. Oh, and it's got little shells, too. And it's iridescent. Oh, my God, I can't believe I just tore it. 
I probably will buy another one. And then this one says, I want to be a mermaid. And it is a pencil pouch. And you can unzip it with this, like, cord. And then it is see-through. And you can put this in your binder if you want to. Then, the last two things that I got in the stationery were some decoupage paid papers. And these papers, like, I really like the deer one. So this is a deer. It's got, and then the other side is like a plaid green. It's like green, like an olive green color. And then the one, this one is flowers and dragonflies. Then this one is butterflies and like that, a wood, like wood look. And then this one is flowers, roses. Now here are things that I got for my home. So I got this Pen Allen, Pen Allen Max Aromas. It's a multi-purpose cleaner. And it deep cleans, cuts, grease, eliminates bad odors, and it is a floral scent. It is scent boost. It looks like this. I've already tried this on my floors, and people said that it stayed for days on their floor. It is a really nice smell. Um, I don't think it stayed for days on my floor, but it was nice and it works good. And this brand Pen Allen I found. I use I've used the dish. The dish, the dish detergent, and it works really good. It's got, it's like a cucumber scent. So these are really good. This brand is really good. So if you get a, if you can find those, I would definitely give them a try. I got some clothes hangers. I got some dryer balls. I'm hoping that these will eliminate me having to buy dryer sheets. So I'm going to have to find those. I got one of these trays and I got some of these paper foil. I was going to make um, chocolate covered, I did make chocolate covered strawberries for Valentine's Day, but they were not photo worthy. <laughs> they did not come out, like they tasted good, but they didn't look good. So I was gonna like use that for my chocolate covered strawberries and take a picture of them you know, and post them on Instagram and all that, but they were not, um, they were edible, they just weren't Instagram worthy, I guess you could say. So anyways, that's why I have those. Maybe, maybe I'll try again another time, and maybe they will work out better. I think I put too much coconut oil in the chocolate. I got one of these clean, it's a microfiber cleaning cloth. And it says that it is absorbent microfibers. You can use the cloth wet or dry to clean away dirt, grease, and grime. And it's suggested for mirrors, windows, glass, appliances, floors, walls, furniture, stainless steel, chrome, brass, computer equipment, cameras, TV screens, CDs, tools, sports, equipment, cars, boats, RVs, and much more. And this reminded me of something that I've seen um, and I watched cleaning videos and someone had something similar to this, but it was from like Grove, I think it was. And I wanted to see how this one works because it says you can use it wet or dry. So that's why I picked that up. I picked up some of these Sure Fresh. Um, it says there's 20 of them. Okay. They're storage sandwich bags and they have the slider seal and there's 20 of them. I got the slider seal because the other ones that I got, I don't know what brand they were. Here they are because they were in my empties. I'll go ahead and show you guys and throw this away now. These are not good. Do not pick up these. These are the Good Scents um, Zipper Seal Sandwich Bags. There's 45 bags in here. It says 10 bags free. I finished these, but these are not good because the seal... When you, like, unseal it, it comes unglued and, like, you can't, I don't know how to explain it, but the part that you seal, it doesn't work right. When you open it, like, it goes like it breaks, the seal breaks, and then you can't close whatever you want to store because it's, the seal is broken. So, I got the zippers, the slider seal. Hopefully, this will work better. I got 
some garden gloves. And these are really pretty flower. I like the yellow. So I pick those up. And I got the Assured brand of the, I've already took these out of the packaging, but this is the Assured Ibuprofen. And these work great. Um, and then this is the Cetaminophen. Cetaminophen. It's compared to the extra strength Tylenol. And that one, I believe, is compared to Advil, the um, ibuprofen. So, yeah, this is compared to extra strength Tylenol. You get 40 of them. So, those work great. I always pick them up. I got one of these um, SureFresh Soup Mugs. And this is Clip Lock Closure Vented Lid BPA Free. You can use it in the microwave freezer or the top rack of top rack dishwasher safe so I picked that up and then I picked up this um, lunch tower storage and this is also BPA free and you can see it has a part a place for it comes apart like this it has this one which you can put your um, dressing or peanut butter or whatever condiment I guess you want to store in it. And then this is the bottom. Whoops. And then you screw that back on. And I got it, these in the gray. Then I already ate this. And it was good. These are really good. So, um, it is the Palmer chocolate. But this one, the white chocolate. And this peanut butter field. It's okay. A peanut butter field white chocolate flavor egg it looks like that and it is good i cut it in half because it's really it's kind of rich and i just had half one day and half another day then i got some of these double bubble i also got my son the russell stover um, milk chocolate bunny then i got this eggs egg shaped bubble gum and they're good i think i got them last year and then, because I love that bee, I got these, um, the set, the pot holders. This is the two pack. So it looks like that. And I'm loving this, um, like lime green. I never used to really like this color. And now I just love it. And I love the little bee. So I also got the microfiber kitchen towel. There's the bee, and there's the one. And then I got the oven mitt. And I use these, like, I use these in the kitchen, like, to take pot. I think people have said that these don't, these don't work good. They, you get, they get burnt using these. Or they burn in the stove or what, when they're taking things out. But for me, they work good, so... So far, they've worked good for me, like the pot holders and towels and everything I bought at the Dollar Tree. Then I got, again with the bee, I got the napkins. And these are really pretty napkins. They're like scallop edges. I got three packs of them. <laughs> And then I got the paper plates. You get 12 of these. I also got the 12, the square ones, but we already used them. And then I got these little paper cups. And these would be good for like ice cream, I think. And that would be the little, these little ones that are like in the shape of a flower. That would be good for like cake, cake or something like that. And then I got some straws because I ran out of straws. So I got these striped straws. And then I got these longer flex straws in the pretty colors. And then I got some toothbrushes. These are nice. These are um, with toothbrushes with travel cases and you get green and blue and red. And then my son needed a toothbrush, so I got this one. This is the close-up medium toothbrush, and I have one left. Then I picked up the Clorox Fragonzia Spring Multipurpose 
wipes. And I have used these before. I bought these at Dollar General and they work really good. The Clorox wipes are really nice. And then I got two different scents of this Suave Tail. Suave Tail. And this is the Morning Sun one. And I love these. And then this is the Field Flowers. And I've used both of these before and they work great. And then I got a Kinder Joy egg. And I got this because, and this is the Star Wars. It is sweet cream topped with cocoa wafer bites. And I was watching 45 and Fab, is her, I think is her channel. And she tasted it and it looked so good. And I just got it just to taste the chocolate. <laughs> because my son, he's like, he's 16. He doesn't, I don't think he's really into this kind of stuff. But I do have the toy is, see I ate the chocolate, but the toy is still in there. Because I haven't, I don't have, I'll probably give it to like a little kid or something. Maybe my little niece or maybe a little kid, just some, a neighbor kid, I'll just give it to them. And then I got some of these electronic wipes. These work really good. I remember one time I had about like a $10 pack from Walmart and... I would never do that again because those were a dollar and they were really they weren't really good then I ran out of this and this is the healthy chef flavored butter flavor no stick cooking spray so I picked that one up again and then I've used this before also and I really love it and it's the Pomala Pomala essential clean raspberry coconut dish detergent it smells really good really nice and I wanted to try this because I like to use this kind of stuff to clean my sink out my kitchen sink and it is lavender fresh so something different and it's comment with the bleach it's scratch free and it says it deodorizes and cleans tough stains so I picked that up and then I needed to stock up on my air fresheners so I bought four of them and I love the Glade and the Airwick, I guess. Because some of these shoot out and I don't, and I'm getting annoyed by that a little bit. But this one is the Hawaii Exotic Papaya and Hibiscus Flower. It's six in one. And this is the essential oil. And this is by Airwick. And it says um, six in one. Premium fragrance, eliminates odors, acts in seconds, lasts up to one hour, propelled by 100% filtered air, inspired by essential oils. So, that one smelled good. And then this is the other air wick, and I've used this scent before. I've had this scent before. It's the White Lilac and Orange Blossom. So, I like that scent. And then I had this scent before, too. So this is by Glade. This is the Red Honeysuckle Nectar. So I love that scent. And then this is like a new scent, I think. And this is the, um, it does say new right there. This is the Elegant Amber and Oud. Designed to fight self odors. It looks like this is kind of essential oil too. So I think that would be a nice scent for fall probably. And I think that is everything that I got from Dollar Tree. I hope you guys enjoy this haul. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.